Constellation round to end his run at uh, hoping as a uh, All-American his final year. He did was an All-American as a sophomore, and then an injury knocked him out of the tournament uh, before he even got there last year. Ian Nickel and Coleman Hammond, Bryce's brother, were both eliminated in their first matches with losses today. So uh, kind of a rough day for Bakersfield. Uh, the basketball team playing a game effort, but losing 82-68 to Oklahoma. And now the baseball team is only three outs away from losing this one and then the wrestling team getting eliminated. So, um, you know, a lot of high hopes at the start of the day. And uh, unfortunately, the Roadrunners, uh, from the Roadrunners' perspective, it hasn't been a sterling day. Although I think the basketball team played about as well as you could expect. The 82-68 loss, it was much closer than that would indicate. They made Oklahoma work really hard in that game. For well, sure. it was a four-point game with about less than five minutes to go and then a couple of three-pointers, and then that pretty much broke it open. Yeah. Here we are now, top of the ninth inning with Jack Flansburg, who hit a two-run home run earlier in the game. He's now at first base. He's been playing second base much of these series. Moten is now the pitcher. 28. Again, a freshman out of Temecula Valley High School. That's the fifth pitcher for Bakersfield, and uh, Oklahoma's used five guys. Nice comebacker. And Moten will work it over to the first baseman. Carter, and that's it. Couple comebackers here. You know, Andrew Hansen pitched well for Bakersfield through five and then uh, ran into a rough sixth inning when he was touched up for four runs. Yeah. And he was on he's on the hook for the loss in this game. Question is, is you know, did you get a little tired there at the end? Uh, well, again, uh, it started with the meat of the order there. And did, at the third time through the order, did the Sooners make some adjustments? Was it a fatigue thing? That's uh, a good question. All right, Moten comes in on well, that last pitch pretty tight to Wise. Here's the 1-0 pitch. Swing and a miss, strike one. Wise tonight is singled, line to center. I'm sorry, line to right field, grounded out, and it was walked. And the pitch, down low, he catches the corner there. And now up ahead in the count, one and two. Sooners need a win today to pull it even at 500. They came in eight, nine, and one. Bakersfield came in 5 and 11. The squibber. And what a play there by the, by the catcher. Junior Felix made a very nice play there. Number one, Steel Walker. Both these teams have players from Temecula on their roster. You wonder if these kids knew each other. They probably, probably do. They did, yeah. Uh, the Southwest Riverside County, one of the more heavily recruited areas for all sports in the country. Steel Walker, the center fielder, two out here in the ninth, five, six to three in favor of the Sooners. Fastball down the middle, 0-1. Oh Moten's control, very impressive, 86 miles an hour on that pitch. Well, it's pretty clear the bullpen jobs are wide open. I mean, they still are wide open. And high fly ball to left field, and that's gonna do it. Easy fly ball there. So One of the more easy innings for uh, CSUB, now they got to last 